Oh, uh, hello out there. Um, I just got a uh, uh, a message from uh, one of the uh, uh, guys in the forum about Bells of Ridney uh, being tuned down to a drop D. Uh, Roger's part is uh, tuned, his low E is tuned down to a D, which is totally correct on that. But when I do it out, I, I don't... Uh, I don't tune down to a drop D. I keep it uh, keep it uh, in regular tuning and prefer to have the rhythm guitar tuned down because it just does when you play you know the, the the chords just don't sound right and and I'll show you how I do it when I you know I I will kick it off like that hit the drop D. Then when, it, then when it shifts, uh, goes to the G, I just play the G. I'll show you the finger in a minute. Fingering in a minute. Uh, like, like I'm playing a G chord, but I play it. Down to the E. Uh, Robert, you're totally right on that. He does tune the low E down to D, but uh, I don't believe he plays those chords. I believe uh, what he's doing is uh, playing the chords up on the neck here, like like I'll show you in one minute. And uh, you know, even even when you would play the solo, you could you know it gives you that nice big full chord. But when you go to the G, you're still going to have to. In the E minor, and the it really doesn't work that well. So, um, yes, if, if you're if you, if you're playing it, you know, the, to, to do the if I was going to record this tune, uh, I would drop it down and. Uh, Do it like that, and of course you can do the solo. You can do it that way, but. Uh, what I believe he's doing uh, up here, uh, if you, we can see, uh, then when he goes to the G, he's playing uh, just the G note on the on the fourth string and the D note on the second string, and just walking the uh, the G. I think that's what he's doing as far as I can hear with the headset set on. So it would be the G here, but, but no high E string. You just want to hit your fourth, third, and second. And when you play down to the E, you got your E note, your G sharp note, and B and E. So you go. Uh, 
uh, as far as your question goes, uh, yes, it was. He was definitely tuned down to a drop D, but I don't think he. I don't think he played all them uh, the chords down here because they just they just don't sound right when, when you do it. Uh, and I think David Crosby was playing those chords against this. <laughs> And I believe the only time he went to that drop D was over that lick. Oh, you know, the begin like the beginning. And every time that D lick came around, he was probably doing it. And I believe maybe in the solo. Once again, Robert, uh, I hope that answers your question. Uh, to the best of my knowledge, I believe that's what he was doing because uh, I, I can't see him playing it any other way, and I, and I actually don't hear it on the recording. I'm hearing... Over that part, then when he goes to the C, it's just that he just doesn't play that low, that low string. So... Once again, uh, Robert, thank you for uh, uh, the reply there and everything like that. And I uh, hope this helps you out. Any more uh, questions or anything I can help you out with, uh, feel free to send me a request. And uh, like I, I posted to you, I have a YouTube channel out there with a lot more videos. So uh, go check it out and uh, let me know what you think. Uh, I'll talk to everybody later. Thank you.